Okay, mine is, um, I just picked it like five minutes ago. Absolutely true diary oh, of a part-time Indian. No. You are doing the most fan book in America. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, um, it was banned because it's vulgar, and it was in the school curriculums, and parents didn't like it. So you guys might see why. Okay, this chapter is uh, Joshua Garcia, if I didn't already say. Because ge geometry is not a country somewhere in, near France. I was 14, it was my first day of high school. I was happy about that. And I was most especially excited about my first geometry class. Yep, I have to, have to admit it. Isosceles triangles make me feel hormonal. Most guys, no matter what age, get excited about curves and circles, but not me. Don't get me wrong, I like girls in their curves. I really like women in their curvier curves. I spend hours in the bathroom with a magazine that has 1,000 pictures of naked movie stars. Naked women, plus right hand, happy, happy, joy, joy. <laughs> yup, that's right, I admit it. I masturbate, I'm proud of it, I'm good at it. I'm ambidextrous. If there were a professional masturbators league, I'd get drafted number one and make millions of dollars. <laughs> and maybe you're thinking, well, you really shouldn't be talking about masturbation in public. Well, tough. I'm going to talk about it because everybody does it and everybody likes it. And if God didn't want us to masturbate, then he wouldn't have gave us thumbs. <laughs> so I thank God for my thumbs. But the thing is, no matter how much my thumbs and I spend with the curvy imaginary women, I'm much more in love with the right angles of buildings. When I was a baby, I'd crawl under my bed and snuggle into a corner to sleep. I just felt warm and safe leaning into two walls at the same time. I was eight, nine, and ten. I slept in my bedroom closet with the door closed. I only stopped doing that because my big sister Mary told me that I was trying to find my way back into my mother's womb. That ruined the whole closet thing. Don't get me wrong, I don't have anything against my mother's womb. I was built in there, after all, so I have to say that I'm pro-womb, pro-womb. But I have zero interest in moving back home, so to speak. My sister's good at ruining things. After high school, my sister just froze, didn't go to college, didn't get a job, didn't do anything. Kind of sad, I guess. But she's also beautiful and strong and funny. She's the prettiest, strongest, funniest person who spent 23 hours a day in, the, in a basement. She's so crazy and random that we call her Mary Runs Away. I'm not like her at all. I'm steady. I'm excited about life, and I'm excited about school. Thank you. So, I've actually never read this book before, but I love it already. <laughs>